Enjoy the story by taking... <laughs> Change various... Enjoy the story by taking... Start from the beginning of the story. Peaceful nightmares will haunt our protagonist. Simple... Average nightmares will haunt our protagonist. Choose... Simple nightmares will... In this mode, all blocks will be the usual size. Very well. Please enjoy the world of Catherine full body at a leisurely pace. Full-bodied wine is the best. Oh dear. <laughs> when the night sky fills with glamour, a lovely story awaits you. Good evening. Welcome to the Golden Playhouse special feature. Do I see some new faces? Once again, your guide for the night is me, the Midnight Venus, Trisha. Have you heard about this scary rumor? They say if you fall in a dream and don't wake up before you land, you die in real life. Tonight's story is Catherine Full Body, the second coming of an unconventional romantic horror. A man with a certain curse has a terrifying and dramatic week. Oh, does that sound familiar? <laughs> well, like I said, this is Catherine, but with a fuller body. It's aged nicely, with a sensual flavor, not unlike a fine wine. Our hero in this story is Vincent Brooks, age 32. He is an earnest and kind man. But one day we begin to see him have terrifying nightmares. Amidst the storm of temptations around him, he has another chance encounter. And an awfully cute one at that. 
But doesn't this seem a little <laughs> convenient? Oh my, sounds like a recipe for a disaster. Will Vincent be able to overcome the massive blocks in his life? Perhaps he'll take a road less traveled. <laughs> his outcome depends on you, viewers. Sorry to keep you waiting. Raise the curtains. It's time to savor the marriage of pleasure and pain. Now enjoy the show until we meet again. Save your breath and start climbing. If you fall, you're dead. I'll die? Are you fucking serious? There's no time limit on safety difficulty, so the ground below will not fall. You have plenty of time to think about your next move. Move the blocks to make a path. You can climb one block at a time, right? How am I supposed to move these things? 
You can grab onto a block with the X button and move it with the directional buttons. Some blocks can be moved, while others cannot. So be sure to experiment. If you make a mistake moving a block, you can press the L1 button to undo it. Moreover, on safety difficulty, you can use autoplay to climb automatically. If you can't figure out how to proceed, press the R1 button to enable autoplay. Alright, I got it. Remix mode, you'll encounter combination blocks. By moving a large block like this as a single unit, you can advance more quickly. All right, I got it. Undo your moves. Edge. These blocks aren't normal. They'll lock into place and support your weight, even if they're only touching by their edges. What's that supposed to mean? They connect at the edges. Even if a block has nothing directly under it, as long as it's touching an edge of another block, it won't fall down. Connecting blocks at their edges to make stairs is the key to successfully scaling the tower. Strive for the goal by creating a path step by step. All right, I got it. Edge. 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 All right, I got it. Edge. Edge. Where is this? What is this ringing? If we both make it out of here alive, we'll meet again. Hey, hey, wait a sec! When you hear the bell ring, you'll know that you've almost reached the goal. Refer to the map located on the left side of the screen to see how much further you have to go. Moreover, on safety difficulty, you have the option to skip to the next stage without needing to reach the goal. If you're unable to reach the goal, try using the skip feature located in the pause menu. All right, I got it. Edge. 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 All right. through here? about to begin. I'll be sure to prepare something extra special for you behind the next door. Let's meet again tomorrow night. I look forward to it.
Hey, where'd you go? Snap out of no. it! Were you even listening? Uh... Sure. You know, you've been a little out of it lately. Is everything all right? You've been spacing out left and right. Oh, sorry. I uh, had to work early this morning. <laughs> And in other news, we have more on the recent string of unexplained deaths that seem to be exclusively involving young men. Cause of death is unknown, and while police are investigating accidental causes, foul play has apparently not been ruled Hey, out. change it! The Chief match is... Oh, no, two beers over here! Coming! Catherine keeps telling me how her mother is constantly calling her. She says she's not worried about it, though. Feather's totally gonna take it, right, Vinny? And what do you think? So, who are you betting on? Come on, pick one. You kidding? Women's wrestling? What I know? Sounds to me like she finally wants you to tie the knot. That? Okay. Hello. Do you know where you are? Okay. Never mind that. Uh, how about a name? Uh, uh, Rin. Rin? That's a nice name. Uh, who is that, though? What's that? Amateur hour. Oh, don't say that. Rin's working really hard. Uh, Vincent? What did you think of my performance? Oh, it was, uh, great. Yeah, it was great. Really, uh, unique. Thank you so much. I was hoping to play a little better than that, but... Don't worry about it. No one gets things perfect the first time around. I guess you're right. I'll have to keep practicing. Yeah, if the bar doesn't go out of business by then. Ah! Well, I'll see you later. See you. <laughs> well, nobody's perfect. I mean, <laughs> if she's that cute, who cares, right? <laughs> What's up with you anyway? Saving some cute girl from a stalker in the streets? Sounds like a daytime soap opera. That stuff doesn't really happen. Well, it did, so give it a rest. Does that girl really have amnesia? Erica, you took her to the doctor, right? Did they find anything? Not really. They think it's only temporary. But it must be hard when the only thing you remember is wanting to play piano. Hey, so are you two really neighbors now? Yeah. The uh, last guy just happened to move out. You better keep your hands off her. Oh, shut up. It's not like that. I, I'm an old man over here. But you guys really came through for us. You know it. Having Rin work here was a great idea, huh? We have you guys and even a police officer as customers. Not to mention, public spaces are a lot safer if she's really being stalked by someone. Yeah.
Oh, hey, Erica. So, she managed to get the job, huh? Of course. I can't just abandon someone with amnesia, especially when they seem like such a good kid. And like Johnny said, there's this innocent cluelessness to Rin that, oh, I just can't help caring about. Not to mention the whole stalker thing. Who would do that, and why? Seems like even she doesn't know. Now how could that be? You should find out. Everything okay now? Yeah, I think so. Um, I wanted to say thanks. Not just for saving me, but also for finding me a job and a place to stay. I was so scared. I couldn't remember anything. I'm so glad I met someone as nice as you, Vincent. It's nothing, really. Anyone would have done the same. Still, you saved me, Vincent. I start working here tomorrow, so I'll do my best to show you my appreciation. You got a mail. From time to time, you'll receive texts at the bar. You can respond to something. Give it a try. change Vincent's inner ideas, a meter will be shown. Vincent's words and actions will affect the story. Remember it. Hey, how many years have we been together? Marriage, huh? I figured this would happen eventually, but just change jobs. I don't want to give her trouble. Out of the blue? It's not like her. You got a mail. sit here
Maybe this will be useful. We're discussing techniques. They're the key to survival. I'll have to use that next time. Damn it! I'm gonna survive! Even if it means kicking off others! If you get in my way, I'll kick you off too! Maybe this will... You want me to teach you the technique I found? Let's do it. All right. Remember, this is Todd's technique. Allow me to explain the pyramid. Pull out the same number of blocks as the number of steps you mean to climb up. You'll have the support you need to reach higher and higher, like a pyramid. Remember this basic technique. What do you think? Nice. Uh, mm, I think that might be tough by itself. Consider using this one too. Allow me to explain the slider. Pull out two blocks vertically, then slide the bottom one over. Remember this basic action, which utilizes the properties of edges. Since edges connect, you can make a stairway, even in tight spots. Oh, you're a genius. How was that? Bet you didn't know. Um, well... Anyway, what I want to say is this. If you're relying on luck to keep you alive, it's all over. I know. My reporter's instincts are telling me this dangerous form of free climbing has some techniques hidden within it. There are many techniques to discover. I guess the key is to find as many as we can. All right. If you find anything, you tell me, okay? That's an order. Ah! What is this place? Why was I taken here? Same here. Wish I knew. What are those cages? Why are there sheep in them? I've had it. Get me out of here. I'll have to use that next time. Where am I? What's with all these damn sheep? That's all I want to know. Can you tell me anything? They told me to go up. What's up there? Give me a break! <laughs> uh, uh, I don't want to die! Shut up. How can I? Everybody here's against me. Everyone's just out to save themselves. Some asshole pushed me too. Next time, I've got to start shoving or I'll die. I'll have to use that next time. Nice to see you here, and welcome to the confessional. Who are you? This is the world of nightmares. I guess you could call me its supervisor. I sense a force of change rising up. What exactly happened in the other world? I guess it doesn't matter. You lambs are all destined to die here anyway. What? Are you ridiculous? But before I kill you, I want to determine the value of your life. So you'll have to answer some questions. Question one. What expectations do you have for your significant other? Pull the rope with the answer that best matches your true feelings. <laughs> oh, so that's your choice. Mm, I guess everybody's different. Hey, who are you? Are you doing all this? I told you. I'm just the supervisor. Someone else brought you here. It's someone you know. <sighs> you never know what people are actually thinking. To learn the truth, you must survive. Then you can think about what's going on here. Let's head to the next trial.
You won't escape. Huh? What? That voice? Where have I? I won't let you escape. What the hell is this? Can't find a way forward. They want to undo and try and do stuff. All right, I got it. All right, I got it. All right, I got it. All right, I got it like this. I'm safe, right? Yeah! Congratulations. You have escaped from the prison of despair. As promised, I have something special to show you tonight. Think back to long ago. Back to a time when you felt happy. Sorry about today. I don't usually burn the bacon like that. It's all right. I don't mind it a little crispy. I can tell something's going on with you. Are you working too hard? <laughs> no, I'm fine. <laughs> You've been gaining weight, haven't you? Can't forget to eat your veggies. Well, I put ketchup on almost everything. <laughs> That doesn't count. You know what? <laughs> hey! <laughs> Maybe a little workout will burn out those extra calories. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think? Fond memories, huh? You should think long and hard about what you have to lose. Let's do this again tomorrow. If you can survive, that is.
here for a taste? It's full body. <laughs>